Hi, I'm Jennifer Marshall Jenkinson, Chairman of the UK Microwave Technologies Association and author of the prize-winning cookbook, Microwave Magic, the Art of 21st Century Cooking. And today I'm going to show you how to make sauces in the microwave. And the sauce I've chosen to make, first of all, is a chocolate custard. And again, what can be easier than making a sauce in the microwave? So, chocolate sauce. I've got here half a pint of milk. I'm adding to that one tablespoon of corn flour. Two tablespoons of sugar. This can be granulated sugar, white granulated, caster, anything you like. And one tablespoon of cocoa powder. All I'm going to do now is give the ingredients a quick stir together. And this is going to take, in total, about three to four minutes to cook, stirring every one minute. So I've just given that a quick stir together at the moment. Let's put this in the oven. As I say, we're going to cook it at one minute intervals. So it's going in the oven there for three to four minutes in total. So there, our sauce has had its first one minute cooking time. And you'll see that the milk has started to heat up. The starch grains in the corn flour have started to distribute. The cocoa here has blended throughout and we've just given it a good stir. So all I want to do is put this back in the oven for another minute and then we'll stir it again. Now I can guarantee you that you'll never ever make a lumpy sauce again if you cook the sauce in the microwave oven. Now I've made, as you can see, a chocolate custard today. You can make custard with normal custard powder or you can make a savoury sauce, a cheese sauce, a parsley sauce in exactly the same way or even your gravy or a sauce to go with a roast meat. Because there's no direct heat source, the actual sauce itself doesn't ever stick to the pan and it won't burn. And also, if the phone rings or the front doorbell goes, you can actually leave the sauce where it is and it won't overcook, burn or stick to the sides of the pan. A quick stir every one minute and I can guarantee that your finished result will never ever have any lumps in it ever again. There's our second minute, so let's have another look at the oven. Right, you can see the sauce is coming together now. It's had two minutes. Another quick stir, just to make sure that there's definitely no lumps here. Back in the oven for another minute. And I think the sauce will be almost cooked at that stage. And there's the end of our third minute. And I think we'll find, in this case, the sauce is cooked to perfection. There we are, we have a lovely chocolate sauce there, cooked in three minutes in the microwave without a lump in sight. So whether it's a custard, a cheese sauce, a savoury sauce or a gravy, guaranteed lump-free if you've made your sauce in the microwave.